Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to add your custom civilization to Age of History that's flag also changes depending on the ideology. The first thing you're going to do is go to Editor, Game Editor, Game Civilizations, and then you're going to click Add a Civilization. You're going to add a code that is not in the game, like a completely unique code. I'm just going to do new nit. And you need to remember that code. So like write it down or something. Choose the color that you want for it. Alright, and then you can customize the ribbon and stuff. Then you're gonna save. It's gonna open Wikipedia. Just close it. Go back to the game. Now there it is. There's the civilization. Now what you want to do is just Exit out, exit the game, and then right click, manage, browse local files, go into the game files, click game, languages, civilizations, bundle properties, open with notepad. Now you're in, a, now you're in the civilizations. Now you want to scroll all the way down. You're gonna go enter, type in your code with the ideology key. The ideology keys, you go back to game, governments. This is where the ideology keys are. So let's say for democracy, we want this country to be, um, hmm. Let's just call it random, no. Legoland, why not? There we go. So after that, check the- let's do a monarchism. So you're going to scroll up, go to absolute monarchy. So you go back to the bundle then. Noon underscore, what is the code for monarchy? M. So noon underscore M, Lego kingdom. And then you do that for like literally every ideology. Like for communism, Lego workers. Alright, then you can just do all, all the things you want. Then you're gonna click File, Save. You're gonna save that. Now we're gonna make the flags. So then you go into Flags, and you have all these flags here. Alright, you're gonna open any flag. I would recommend just any, open it with anything. Any paint program that you got. I use paint. Now we're gonna create the flag. You can create your own flag or just do something else. Let's just do a flag for Lego or something. Yeah, this. This is going to be the de democratic flag. I'm going to save that. Now you're going to save it as the exact code that you put into the bundles property. Save it. Then you're gonna do the next ideology. Same thing. You just make your flag. Let's just, for the monarchy, we'll just do, uh, we'll do this. Let's do that for that. You're gonna do that, the exact same code. Then for communism, uh, I don't know, communism, hammer and sickle. communist flag, or any ideology that you're doing. And you're going to also save it, as what you did. There. Then you're done. Then you can reopen the game. Alright. You reopen the game. Now let's Open an editor, create a scenario, and we'll see if our civilization was added. Go in here. It should be what you named it. And there it is, Legoland. Lego Kingdom. Lego Workers Party. 
And that's how you add your own custom civilization that changes flags when you change the ideology. Thank you for watching, and I hope uh, if you if this worked for you, uh, let me know because that's supportive. And if you had problems, just let me know, and let me know if you want more Age of History tutorials.